A museum of fine arts attraction delayed because of the pandemic is now quickly selling out. Anna Ritas Rodriguez visited the Basquiat exhibit said to be unlike any other. Away from the growing bustle of Boston, inside the halls of the Museum of Fine Arts, an artful respite is beaming with life. Nothing like this has ever been done before in Boston or the world. That's Liz Monzel, co-curator of Writing the Future, Basquiat and the Hip Hop Generation. Music, fashion, painting, sculpture, you get it all here. An exhibition of 120 pieces of art from Jean-Michel Basquiat and his peers, like hip-hop pioneers Fab Five Freddy and Ramel Z. Multiple galleries of unique pieces build a timeline of Basquiat's influence during the post-graffiti movement, like the vinyl of the record he produced. And, uh, becomes one of the most important tracks in hip-hop history. And classic works like Hollywood Africans, a painting where he critiques popular culture in American society after a trip to Los Angeles with friends. I make quite a scene and quite a statement in what was a very white scene. Through words like gangsterism and he heroism. Basquiat's talking about this duality of these limited roles African Americans are given to play in the industry of Hollywood. The lower level of the museum has been transformed to resemble a subway. Because of the pandemic, the exhibition opened six months late and quickly sells out. He, together with his friends, I think made a big impact. And particularly in these really hard times for artists, uh, I think Learning that you can band together um, to make a difference is something I'd love for people to come away from this show thinking about. The exhibit runs through mid-May. In Boston, I'm Anna Rodriguez, WBZ News.